morning guys today we are going to hook the ford tractor up to a i can't remember if it's a five or a six foot box blade that my neighbor has and we're going to box blade this road and do my driveway along with it uh it rained this past week for about three and a half four straight days so the road is i mean some a lot of the gravels in the ground some of it washed off to the side. There's potholes developing. So we're going to hook up the box blade and we're going to take care of that. I really am anxious to do this because the last time I did it, um, my tires were not loaded. And there was just air in them. And it pulled on the, fl pulled on the flat land pretty good. But when you got to some of the hills, it, the tires would just spin out. So I'm really anxious to see with that extra weight in the tires how well they're going to grab. Um... So, I got something I need to do to this tractor real quick. Uh, bolt into the toolbox. And then after that, we're going to go across the field and we're going to hook it up. It is a beautiful day. It is, everything's getting green. It's going to be upper 60s, about 70 degrees today. Just absolutely gorgeous. And I need to get this done because I need to cut the grass afterwards. So, uh, let's get going. Got the toolbox on there. Just topped it off with fuel. So we're going to see. If she fires up. Go ahead and pull the choke out. Get a little throttle. I need a bigger garage. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Turn the fuel on. She should fire right up.
not as smooth as I usually like, but way, way better than it was before. Brought up all that gravel. This was all solid mud where all that was packed down after all that rain. Way, way better than what it was. Uh, you did good, old girl. 75 years old, baby. Still going. All right. Well, that'll do it for this video. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put this away and get started on cutting the grass. Yay. But uh, catch you guys on the next project. See ya.